right, guys, it's that time of the week again. It's time for Saturday's Stockman Stampede. That's brought to us by Terry's Diets and Man Stuff. Boy, the light just kills the decals. But be sure you check out his channel. Let, let him know that Big J sent you over. He, you know, I talk to him all the time. But in, in honor of Terry's Night, let's do a let's do a watch check. I got me a fishing watch, guys. This fishing gear watch from Casio. I'm gonna try it out. Um, I guess the fish ain't active right now, but let's see if they're gonna be here. Oh, look at there. We got some fish activity at 8 a.m. Yeah, it uses the moon phase, and it, you know, you can course through the, oh, at 8 o'clock tonight, we got some fish activity, but hey, man, check that out. So I can't wait to try that out, see if it actually really works, but it's, it's 6.30 in the morning here on Saturday. I've got some chores done for the day, so I figured I'd do my Stockman Stampede video before I go to the, to the gym. I got my pre-workout about it, about done, and uh, we're going to go lift some weights, but uh, look at this thing. But uh, first of all, I want to talk about a, a, a channel, um, Driver38. Guys, a great dude, great channel, great videos. Um, did a great story the other day on a Benchmade knife he had got from one of his friends that he worked with, one of his close friends, and he tells a story about that. So if you haven't seen that video, please go watch that. It, it really uh, touched me and, uh, you know, it really... Uh, Really some great advice in that video. I don't want to spoil it, but Driver38, please go watch his Benchmade video from the other day. And he also did a cooking video, making some good biscuits. Um, and it, it was just a great video, a great time watching that. So be sure you check out his channel as well. And 865 Knives, Muskrat Mafia. Is this, look at this stag on this one. Got the carbon Shield. USA, bud, right here. Is this... Maybe I'll do me a Muskrat Mafia video and show a few of my Muskrats. Ooh, snap ability. But anyway, I don't want to spoil that. But guys, we got us a Case 75 today for Stockman Stampede. Um, really don't know a lot about this knife. Uh, it was on All About Pocket Knives. Uh, I don't know. I think I gave. I think he wanted 75, and it said you could make an offer. I think I made an offer of 60, and he took it. And uh, I knew it was carbon steel because, you know, he showed the blades and, you know, it's got some, definitely has some carbon spots, as you know, you can see it there. And the lighting just is brutal this morning in here. Now this right here is a, I think there's five dots there, so it'd be a 1995 knife because it's got the 1990s case double X and the, the C or, I, I don't know what you want to call, I don't know, I'm tired. There you go. You got the big old sheep's foot with 6375 on it there. And, you know, it's got the teeners on the back of the blade. And I'd say it, uh, they'd use this and probably just didn't put it upright or something. It ain't been used much. And you got the old spade blade here. It's got some carbon spots on it as well. And I bought this and I was like, I was going to use it, but. I got my other 75, you know, I got these 75 I like to use. You know, look at that, te look at that teeter tail on this thing. <laughs> I've been using this and, man, a couple other of my carbon blades and just, I don't know, I've mostly been using my dang, uh, I don't even have it in here, but my uh, sow belly, that's my favorite knife right now. My case stag sow belly that I got from GR Knives and a tray and a swap. If you look, we got a little bit of, just a little bit of capping right there, but nothing big, nothing severe. It's got some, got some good bone on it. Um, I don't know, it's got a little bit of, someone's dropped it here and you know, and there's a little dent in the bolster. That's just a little, that's just a little character. But I bought this, I oiled it. And I was going to throw it in my pocket, but I've got so many other knives that I've been carrying and just fell in love with that I just haven't had a chance to carry it yet. But And then I was thinking, what am I going to shoot this morning for a video? And I was like, well, I got that, that 75 that I've never really messed with in there that I bought a while back. And I figured I'd just show it. But man, look at that. It does have some good looking bone on it right there. 
I guess this is brown, but I, you know, when it comes to the jigging and the, the collar, I'm not super into that. You know, I know, you know, I'm not super, what do you want to call it? Educated in the actual collars and the bone and the jigging and all that. Like some people are like doom crew. I know he can look at a knife and he can tell you mostly what the jigging is and the collar right off the top of his head. He is very good with that stuff. Man. The, I don't know. Good looking knife. I thought, heck, for, for 60 bucks, I probably have 65 in it delivered. And the old boy was from West Virginia. So I, uh, I had to, you know, I had to talk to him about West Virginia and stuff like that. But, uh, again, old Mo over at Kirby Creek, uh, Carver. I think he changed his YouTube name, but I'm also friends with him on a couple of other platforms. So he's just a great dude. But this is Branch Manager Barry here at Big J's Knives. If you look, old Mo signed it. That is awesome right there how he signed that. Um, but this is the Branch Manager now. He makes he makes sure I stay on my toes over here. And, you know, and don't forget about RDS Wood Turning in Acrylics. Um, he makes some great beads. Um, all kinds of uh, things, um, beads, pins, um, like tumbler style cups. I know I bought my mother a big tumbler for her birthday and uh, had it shipped to her. And Also a keychain. He does a uh, keychain that holds uh, toothpicks and whatnot. But a uh, very talented feller. Very, very talented. Um, yeah, guys, um, this is a quick little video today. Let's just talk, you know. Again, Terry's Knives and Man stuff. Be sure you sub to him. And Driver 38, man, I, I'll tell you, like uh, Doom Crew put out a video here here today, and he talks about being an old soul and, and things like that. And I think you know I'm kind of I kind of fall in that category as well. But I, you know, I am a grandpa, but you know, um, I just grew up in a different area, a different time, and you know, around them old timers. And I just I used to go to the uh, barber shop and they them old timers just sitting there and talk all day on a Saturday and you'd just sit there and listen and man uh just a great time growing up in an area like that and being able to do stuff like that and not the big cities and the, you know the hustle and bustle and who's got the newest this and that and you know who's driving a, a big old nice brand new Cadillac you know but uh yeah I don't know guys I'm just a simple guy with an old soul, I guess. I love these old case blades. Um, but yeah, guys, that's going to be about it. I'm going to head to the gym this morning. i got a bunch of yard work to do. We're going to finish the garden. we got the garden about three-quarters of the way done. We planted three-quarters of it last weekend. we got, uh, I think, some peppers left we got to put in today. And, of course, I need to mow because I don't like mowing on Sundays. I like to, Sundays, I like to be able to go fish or... I kind of just do what I want because, you know, I'm on the go all day, every day, it seems like, you know, leave the house at 5.30 and get home at about 6.30 at night every day. And it, it just uh, kind of wears on a feller after a while. You need a day to just kind of decompress and relax and take it easy. And Sunday's that day for me. I, I like to have that Sunday free now, especially... Now that the lives aren't going on, you know, we got all this other stuff that we got to get done and having a day just kind of to yourself to kind of reset and things like that. A fella needs that once in a while, but that's enough of me kind of talking. I need it. It's what time is it? It's 638. I got to get to the gym. The cleaning guy lets me in early, so <laughs> I got to take advantage of it. All right, guys, like, subscribe, leave me a comment. Don't forget about driver 38, 865 knives. Muskrat, Mania, and of course, Terry's Knives and Man stuff. Check them all out. Let them know Big J sent you. All right, guys. Take her easy.